Welcome back, folks. My first guest tonight is best known for his 13 seasons on NCIS. He now stars as Dr. Jason Bull in the highest rated new show on television, Bull. Please welcome back Michael Weatherly. Yeah. Thank you for being here. Thank you for rubbing your ass on my desk. <laughs> well, so few of my guests. There's no toilet paper in your dressing room. And I, Chrissy Hines causing a ruckus. I don't know if you've been down there. And Carrie Fisher, she's running around like a nut job. Carrie I Fisher's here with her dog. It is so crazy out there backstage. Mm -hmm. So I. I the Chesterfield, you know, Chesterfield King girls and their cigarette boxes back there <laughs> yeah. and everything. Everyone's trying on your, your triangle Trump hat. Every, it's, it's, it's gone crazy back well, there. Well, welcome back. Welcome back, Bull. I know. What a name. 15 million people, huh? I didn't have Them's it, his ratings. I could have probably done some better thinking about, because, you know, Dinozo for 13 years has been, people yell, Dinozo! Right, Dinozo, right, right, yeah. Which is fine. But, you know, when people just in traffic randomly go, Bull! <laughs> wow. it's, I mean, I didn't anticipate that it would actually feel like an accusation, you know. <laughs> My name. Yeah, no, there's passion <laughs> behind it. Yes. Yeah. Bull! Yeah, that's me. Thank you. Now, the show itself is got a. It, okay, the premise is you're somebody who <laughs> helps your psychologist you're gonna, you're gonna, put together juries. You're right? gonna try and explain the show? No. Okay, because it's, it's. I'm gonna tricky. start. You can take it away from me at any moment. Okay. You, you're a psychologist who helps put together juries for lawyers. Yes. Okay. Yes. So that is a good. Yeah, that's in the service of justice. Well, or is that in the service of Stephen? Winning? Stephen, we live in interesting times. Yeah, we do. A certain moral ambiguities are fascinating, uh, yeah. and so on the show, bull. What we do <laughs> is we um, we try to figure out when you're doing a deselecting a jury. We try to figure out why does this person say uh, have a certain set of beliefs that. Yeah. Another person, say, has a counter, contrary set of beliefs. And boy, how do we get those two people to have the same person that they vote for? Yeah, Dr. Yeah. Phil. Dr. Dr. Phil, Phil started his career doing he this. He had a company called CSI before there was a show CSI. Uh -huh. And he looked into court sciences. And that's really a, a remarkable thing. So, like the OJ trial, you saw that whole. Uh, yeah, yeah. That happened about 20 something years ago. Yeah, yeah, I remember. But then they did the documentary last summer. And right, that was right. fascinating. Yeah. They, you look at how that jury was selected. And rather than being in Santa Monica, they were in downtown Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. And how that affected the outcome of the trial. So and is the point, is your character's goal to have <sighs> just as effective uh, justice as was in evidence in the O.J. trial? <laughs> in other words, does it matter, does it matter to your character, does it matter to okay, the show yes, whether yes. the person is innocent or not, or yes, just if you win? Yes, of course. What we're really doing is we're helping people who can't help themselves and who need that extra leg up when uh, law gets tricky. And your character does it for free? Sometimes. Wow. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Well, obviously, he doesn't need the money. He's got a TV show. Yeah, I mean, he's very... <laughs> he's Dr. Phil. He's Dr. Phil. Does this end up with you uh, having, being, getting bald and having a talk show? Is that what... <laughs> The, the ultimate, the final episode of this? 15 years from now, that might be the, uh, that would be a very interesting, so this is an origin story, is that what you're saying? That's what I'm asking, yeah, yeah. Is this the, uh, the really superhero that is Dr. Phil? <laughs> mm -hmm. Then this, he's bitten by a radioactive Oprah. You've just blown, becomes... <laughs> you've just blown my mind. Yeah, so we've got a clip here. This is, uh, this is a clip of, uh, well, you just doing what Bull does, man. Jim? We move to strike this juror. Don't smile. You can't smile. You didn't just win the lottery. You struck a juror. You give anything away, the prosecution will catch on. So just show me. No. Yep, but don't look nervous. Show me your neutral face. That's more sad clown. We'll work on this. Don't think about it. Oh, boy. I'm just trying to help the people. Trying to help the people. Well, you know it's a good show. It is. It's a, you know it's, it's a, a good show because it seems to have the most screens per cast member <laughs> of any show. 
Why are there so many screens? There are. Why are there so many screens? Are, are HD screens cheaper than sheetrock at this point? Yes. <laughs> So here's what happened. Somebody must have done some sort of focus testing at sure. some point, and they deduced that screens people like, right? Excellent. So, and I heard that if you put maps on a screen, people really like it. Look at that. See, they that's, like that's, it. That's not a map. It's not? <laughs> that's a photograph. That's a photograph of Central Park. Oh, gosh. That's not a map. I'm sorry. Remind me never to go camping with you. <laughs> So wait a second, let me ask you something. One of your cast members, uh, Christopher Jackson, uh, was the original George Washington. Oh, in yes. Hamilton. Did he do, yep. Has he hit by any chance? Have you talked to him at all about his reaction to this whole Mike Pence Hamilton thing? Oh, yeah. I talked to Chris last night, and uh, we worked early this morning outside. It was about 28 degrees with the wind chill factor. Yeah, yeah. So we had a very cold conversation about yeah. it. Uh huh. And I was like, so was that totally weird that, like, you know, the Mike Pence thing? And he was like, yeah, it was a little weird. You know, we. <laughs> You know, but it's freedom, and you're supposed to be able to say, you know, what you think. And the theater is a safe place, but it's also a safe place to say the things you, you think. Should we go in the car and get warm? You know. So that was our Hamilton I'm discussion. I'm cold now. That's how good of an actor you are. Yes. Oh. Well, Michael Weatherly, everybody. Michael Weatherly. Michael, lovely to see you. Thanks for being good here. Good to see you, too. Bull airs Tuesdays at 9 on CBS. Michael Weatherly, everybody. We'll be right back with Carrie Fisher. Dog is coming.